I found the top 10 easiest work from home job companies that are always hiring. These are companies that are relatively easy to get into. Plus they may have jobs that don't have a lot of previous requirements, such as a college degree, a bunch of previous experience and a bunch of skills. And once you get the job, it does tend to be relatively chill. So these are the three criteria that I was looking for when I was looking for these different types of companies. And the first one on the list is going to be Randstad USA. And this is a company that specializes in recruitment and staffing services, and they hire for a ton ton of different types of jobs, just to name a few, a senior manager for a medical review committee, tax managers, work from home customer service, remote call center sales, benefits specialists, etc. And by the way, all of these companies have relatively good reviews online. So for instance, this one on glassdoor.com is 3.7 out of five stars, which is great. 71% would recommend to a friend and 82% of the people approve of the CEO. So overall, this is a pretty good one. There's a lot of lower and mid-level positions that you can apply for. They're currently currently hiring for hundreds of different positions. And many of them are on the easier side where you don't need much previous experience. You don't need to have a lot of skills or college degree, etc. So I'll give it a nine out of 10 opportunity score. The next one on the list is going to be 24 seven virtual assistants. And this is a company that provides remote virtual assistant services to other businesses. Like all the companies on this list, it has a great rating online, 3.9 out of five stars. And 77% of the people who work there would recommend to a friend. And virtual assistants tend to make about 45 $4,000 a year. So yeah, this is a pretty easy one to get into and get started with as well. You don't need a college degree. You don't need previous experience. There's many different companies that hire virtual assistants. So I'll give this one an opportunity score of nine out of 10. Another one on the same list in case that one doesn't work out for you for whatever reason is going to be virtualassistanttalent.com. Now this one does hire a bunch of different types of virtual assistants, but they focus a bit more on digital marketing related virtual assistants. So they hire for positions such as web developer and design designer, telemarketers, social media marketers, real estate related positions, human resource related positions, executive admins, article and blog writers, accounting and bookkeeping related VAs, and insurance related VAs. And again, virtual assistants make on average about $44,000 a year, but if you specialize in something, you can make much more than that. And even just specializing as being a general digital marketing assistant, you'll make around $49,000 a year. So yeah, another good one, another good opportunity to look into. I'll give it a nine out of 10 opportunity score as well. The next one on the list is going to be cfstaffing.com. And they hire for a lot of different accounting and finance related positions. So this one is gonna be specifically for people who have an accounting or finance degree, but there are a lot of those in the United States. It's one of the most common types of degrees. And this company has excellent ratings online. 4.6 out of five stars on Glassdoor, 97% would recommend to a friend and 99% approve of the CEO. So this is a company that treats people really well. And they are currently hiring for hundreds of different roles and they are of course a staffing agency. So I'll just talk about a few of them. Accountants make about 75,000 a year. Executive recruiters make 118,000. Business development managers make 145,000. Accounts payable specialists make 57,000. And senior accountants make $105,000 a year. So yeah, another really good one, only available for certain people, of course, but I'll give this one a seven out of 10 opportunity score and a lot better if you are one of those people who has an accounting degree or a finance degree. The next one on the list is going to be cybercoders.com. And this is a company that connects job seekers with a bunch of different opportunities in technology as well as business. And on top of that, they have a bunch of open positions themselves. So you can get hired in two different ways here. You need job? I have a job for you. You can get hired by the company directly or they can help you find a position. So right now, for instance, they are hiring recruiters and inside sales representatives. And by the way, becoming a sales representative in the technology industry is one of the most lucrative paths you can possibly take. I've talked about it many times on this channel, the path of going into tech sales and typically the entry level career that you start out in is going to be a business development representative or sales development representative. And that stands for BDR or SDR. And I've interviewed a ton of people on this channel that have been able to get into tech sales. Most of them did not have a college degree or any previous experience in tech sales, and they also didn't have skills. And yet they were able to get that first entry level job relatively quickly, sometimes in as little as a month. And they all did it with a company called Course Careers. And Course Careers does have a free training for tech sales that'll basically answer any questions you have about it. I'll put that down in the description as well as the pinned comment below. And if you decide to upgrade to their paid product, which is basically a cohort based teaching experience, I do have a $50 off 
coupon. So it's usually $500, at least at the time of making this video, they're probably going to raise their prices because honestly, that's ridiculously low, but I do have a $50 off coupon, which is Shane 50. I'll put that down in the description as well as the pinned comment below too. But overall, I really like this company. A lot of good opportunities there. I'll give it an eight out of 10 opportunity score. The next one on the list is going to be onlineverdict.com. And this is a website where individuals can actually participate as virtual jurors. And then they review legal cases and give feedback to attorneys. Now, this one is more of a side hustle type thing. It's a way of making some extra money on the side. You probably are not going to be able to make a full-time income from this. But with that being said, it is typically very easy to start making money with this. So I decided to include one of these on the list. And typically you're going to get paid 20 to $60 per case. And each case takes about 20 minutes to 60 minutes to review. So you're getting paid about $1 per minute, which isn't bad. So overall, pretty good one to make some extra money. I'll give it a seven out of 10 opportunity score. The next one on the list is going to be Belay. Now you can find Belay at this website right here. I'll pop it up. And they like to provide virtual bookkeeping services. And bookkeeping is basically where you keep track of the financial transactions within a company. And bookkeepers at this company make about $53,000 a year. And contrary to popular belief, you actually do not need to have an accounting or a finance degree in order to become a bookkeeper. You actually don't have to have any degree at all. So these types of positions are relatively easy to get into. So overall, I'll give this one an opportunity score of eight out of 10. The next one is going to be languageline.com, also known as Language Line Solutions. And this is a company that provides language interpretation services. And one of the positions they hire for, of course, is interpreter. And interpreters make about $47,000 a year at this company. So this is one that would be great for you if you're multilingual, because that means there's just not that many other people to compete with. So if you're one of those people who grew up and you know like two or three different languages, this might be one for you to look into. And overall, it's going to be a great opportunity for you in that case. But overall, most people probably don't know a bunch of different languages, at least most Americans don't. So I'll give it a 7.5 out of 10 opportunity score. I mean, Americans barely even know English. Let's be honest. The next one on the list is going to be kellyservices.com. And this is a company that connects job seekers with a wide range of different positions. And they do have US jobs, international jobs, and you can even apply to work at Kelly Solutions themselves. So for instance, one position you might get hired for is recruiter and they make $79,000 a year. But they're also hiring for tons of other positions such as administrative assistant at 44,000, lab technician at 46,000, customer service representative at 39,000, talent advisor at 93,000, and technical support representative at $46,000 a year. So there's a lot of lower and mid-level positions available at this company, has really good ratings online, and a lot of the positions are relatively easy. So for that reason, I'll give it a nine out of 10 opportunity score. Next, let's talk about the company concentrics.com. And this is another worldwide company, and they specialize in providing customer support solutions for other companies. And they are currently showing over 1,500 jobs available on their website. And customer service representatives here make a about $38,000 a year but there is a ton of other jobs that they're hiring for. So this one has a lot of different opportunities, a lot of jobs that are kind of easy to get into and probably relatively easy when you start. I'll give it a nine out of 10 opportunity score. Now, if you like this one, check out my 17 remote job companies that are almost always hiring video. You can check that out by clicking right here.